Welcome to Tamish Marks, 10th standard NCRT trigonometry. We have three problems in the book. Let's discuss that. Problem 1. If sin theta plus cos theta is root 2, then what is going to be the value of tan theta plus cot theta? Okay. Now, sin theta plus cos theta is root 2. Square both sides. Sine square plus 2 sine theta cos theta plus cos square. A plus B whole square. Sine square plus cos square 1. So 2 sine theta cos theta is 1. Sin theta cos theta is 1 by 2. So the value of sin theta cos theta is 1 by 2. Let's have that. Let's have that. Now we want the value of tan theta plus cot theta. Let us see how it will be. Tan theta plus cot theta. tan theta sin theta by cos theta and cot theta is cos theta by sin theta. Take LCM. Sin square plus cos square which is 1 by sin theta cos theta. But sin theta cos theta already we saw the value was 1 by 2. So, 1 by 1 by 2, 2. The answer is 2. Fine. Next we go for. What's going to be the value of cosecant square theta minus tan square theta of the angle 90 minus theta. Tan square 90 minus theta. 90. This is theta. So, this will be 90 minus theta. Because all the angles of a triangle added together will be y degrees. So let's just say this is x, this is y and this is z. What is tan opposite and adjacent? Opposite and adjacent are connected opposite by adjacent. Tan 90 minus theta is equal to y by x. What is cot theta? What is cot theta? Adjacent by opposite. So tan 90 minus theta is equal to cot theta. Like that you can try what we sign 90 minus theta, what is it equal to all that I leave to the viewers to try. Now this, come to this, cosecant square theta. What is tan 90 minus theta? Cot theta. So that will be cot square theta. 1. That's the answer to that. Next we go for the third one. Now before I could uh, work the third one, I will give you the value of two angles. Tan of 45 degrees is 1. Sine of 45 degrees is 1 by root 2. Secant 45 degrees is root 2. And cosecant 45 degrees is also root 2. These values uh, to be known by you by heart. Okay, and it will come to you provided you spend time every day and make yourself very familiar with that. What will be the familiarity of your name? I ask you what's the name? Will you think, ah, oh, my name is. Will you say like that? No, no. That fluency, like an involuntary action, like that, these values should be for you so that you are extremely successful in mathematics in your NCRT. Okay? Please have all these values to you like an involuntary action, the speed of an involuntary action. Like that, this should be. Now, 15 tan square theta plus 4 into 1 plus tan.
tan square theta. Second square theta is 1 is equal to. Second square theta is 1 plus tan square theta. 15 plus 4. 15 plus 4. That's 19. Plus 4 goes to that side 19. So tan square theta is 1. Tan theta is 1. Of course plus or minus 1. But we take it as 1. Now you come here. Secant theta. Tan theta is 1. That means theta is 45 degrees. What is secant theta I told you? Root 2. And what is cosecant theta? Root 2. Whole square. Minus. 1 by root 2 whole square. This is 2 root 2 whole square. Yay. Minus 1 by 2 which is 15 by 2. So I hope all the problems are clear for you. So the most important thing which you should remember in today's class is tan 45 is 1, sin 45 is 1 by root 2, secant 45 is root 2, cosecant 45 is root 2. And then tan 90 minus theta is cot theta. So practice all this before we could meet in the next video. Till then bye.